sir. You will be able to help me out. How are you doing? And I thought I could fit a little bit better than kids, man. So well, take it off. It looks kind of cool. Oh! <laughs> My God, thank you. Excuse me? Yes. Could you help me? I think it's too small. I, yeah, I thought that it would like type fit one, but like I can This not, is a size four to five. Not, and what do you want to, what are you trying I'm to trying do? I'm trying to get it further on, but I can't. I don't think your arm's going to go through You it. don't think so? I've been going to the gym a lot. Four to five children's stuff. Little boys. I don't think it's going to fit. That? It's, uh. Yeah, it is a little tight. Right now it is cut way up here. Yeah, I can feel it, it cutting off the circulation. Lift your arms up. Okay. Yeah. Uh, you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Okay. Oh, that had a big head, huh? Jeez. Oh, yeah, your mother probably wasn't happy. <laughs> <I'm> just... <laughs> no, I was actually C-sectioned. If you're going with that, you'd have to go with, like, if you got an extra large, then it might fit. super skin tight. I know you've been going to the gym, but right. it's going to fit and it will, it'll show off, you know, that you've been working out. It will. Can you tell that I've been working out? Like, I look pretty. Oh, yeah. What? Well, see, look at those biceps. Yeah, I'm pretty strong. Like a, your head will definitely go through it better than this one. It'll be game over then, huh? That's right. I'll Dude. finally be able to steal my brother's girlfriend, huh? Now see, but it's still nice and snug. Oh, yeah. See? Oh, yeah, that looks good. Doesn't that show off the physique? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, oh man, see it just really brings out those My biceps. brother's girlfriend, not gonna last a chance, huh? Would that be bad, But see, but if, yes, that would be bad. So don't try to, what about my other brother's wife? That'd be probably worse, probably. Probably. I bet you, you could get a pretty girlfriend all by really? yourself. Be a friend to them first, and don't come off as creepy, and... So if I like wear this, and I go up and I'm like... And you're really nice. Hey, like come to my house later, like kind of thing like that, then... Then that won't work. And yeah, I'm excited go to like the club or something and just like go, you know, be like, hey girl. Well, you know, there are... I try to only work out my biceps most of the time because mm -hmm. I think that's like the only thing that like really matters, but... Oh, yeah. Do you think there's any cute girls in the Walmart I could... There's always cute girls. Like, look, there's a cute girl going down there. Right there. I won't even say anything. I'll just go like this and see if they like look at me. There you go. Do you, is this good? Is that good? Yeah. All right, I don't know what you're putting it on. Cake. Or would one of those be better? Never mind. That's not even frosting. What about like one of these ones? Oh, that's just cake, isn't it? I work out. Mm -hmm. Did you tell I, like when I grabbed it? I'm not gonna lie. I didn't even need frosting. I was just trying to get attention for my body. But. What's up? Up? You, oh, I yeah, I play football. What, what do you need help with? Oh, I thought you asked me if I no, played football. No, I, I could have gone pro, well, but I had the injury and stuff. But I, I thought you heard some. I thought you asked me something like that. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another Carson Grant Vlogs video. Back at it again with another prank. In this video, we have a very special idea planned. As of really today, we have a new recruit in our midst. Uh, this is yes, Yancey. Uh, he is going to be our up-and-coming apprentice. He is our uh, little boy that we're going to train in the art of the Sind. So we have a really good uh, opportunity for him to be hazed, slash recruited, slash like uh, interviewed to see if he'll be a great part for the team. I'm not going to tell you what that is. I'm just going to cut to it. You guys will probably be surprised, but I think you'll enjoy it. <laughs> hey, hey, no, 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 no. Hey. Dude, what the hell? <laughs> what? Did he just help you? Yeah. 
He grabbed the blanket and pulled everything over. <laughs> so the new recruit Yancey has proved himself in interview part one. He did an excellent job as the, what would you call that? The hostage in the back of my car. But obviously on the team, we have other roles that one must play as well. One of the main qualities we look for when looking for new recruits is somebody who can be ladylike. You know, we want somebody gentle, pretty, that can, you know, really dress up and, and really get involved and, and, and be kind and elegant. So without further ado, Yancey, come on from over here. Uh, so we have Yancey in a nice dress that I own. For the ladylike test, we are going to go to the ball. So, tisk tisk, as they would say. heard about this dance and it is a lot bigger than we expected oh, a lot bigger. so poor Yancey's really getting a run for his money right now we don't we're, we're not gonna show mercy even on the newcomers like mm -hmm. we're throwing him right in the fire if I gotta yeah. do shit he gotta do shit too. yeah so we're gonna make this happen he's gonna go in there he's gonna look beautiful and we're gonna dance like we've never danced before also I only know about this dance because Nate this is like his event that he's going to uh, and so we like followed him here he's somewhere in this group hopefully he doesn't recognize us too quick let's go, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Public space. so awkward well alrighty everybody I believe our young lad Lancey has proved himself on the court field war zone on the battlefield yeah. today on the battlefield today he's proved himself on the battlefield today so Yancey good job welcome yeah. to the the crew you've shown yourself to be an avid student of the Cinda Academy uh, Yancey also is still a young lad so you know poor baby's got a bedtime <laughs> got 10 p.m. curfew for the young lad, so he's gonna head home. But don't you worry, we're not done yet. I still have one perfectly good slice of pizza that needs to be delivered to somebody. When did you guys get a delivery? Was it was this one of you? What is the name? Barry McCockner. <laughs> what? What was your name? What? Well, my name is Carson. What was the name for the delivery? Barry McCockner. I don't get why that's funny. No, that's their name on the app. Sorry, Sorry. excuse me. It was like Hugh Janus, I think. Hugh Janus? Yeah, it was like a Burger King order. Stupid job, anyway! How's it going, guys? Yeah, it was just like I got like a prank DoorDash order. I took a half and she took the whole thing, slow down, baby. 
We took a trip, now we on your block and it's like a ghost town Baby, 